Hey everybody, and welcome back. I have another, oh, this thing has been so cool. I got a little updated planner video. This, I'm calling this my personal planner, even though it is not personal size. This is personal as to, this is my content one, my billing one, this is my personal one. I should say my school planner, because that's, pretty much what it is so I have I need to get or make an envelope right here to put to hook in here I found my birthdays um, book and um, this is just an FYI if you can find a perpetual um, book or calendar a little calendar this one is back from 2018 I need to take that off of there but I list it lists um, it lists the days of the month all the way down to 30 on each month that has like May has 31 days April has 30 days or whatnot and then I wrote in here Tuesday Wednesday Thursday that does not matter that doesn't matter it's just the day I'm using it just for my day and I put in birthdays or anniversaries um, you know stuff I don't want to forget for each month and so this is my monthly I can go in here like August so this month for August if I want to remember what's going on I'll pull this out write it in here and so I know this birthday's coming up now I only have two birthdays in August I have my stepson's which was on the third and he just, and I also put, because I need to remember when he was born, because I forget, I'm getting older, I don't remember. So I put the year he was born right here. So that tells me, it'll tell me how old he is. He just turned 32. I thought he turned 31. He's 32, he laughed at me. He said, Mom, I'm 32. I'm like, wow, it's already been two years since you're 10, 30? Holy crap. And so I also want to keep track of my reborn dolls that I have for me and I'll put the date the kit name the date and um, their birthday you know and I'll list them over here for reminders because that's what I'm using that for but I thought that would be a little FYI I found that so that's in here I've got the school calendar that was on the website and I went through and added things through the year so far and fix thing this is what I want to show you is what I had to fix um, I filled out the monthly one the month calendar is not going to be pretty right now I guess it's because I'm a little overwhelmed and I need to get it okay I need to get it going here so I did write in everything for this month this is her school thing back to school she actually got her backpack ready today and it's a couple of days before school starts so she's a little we're getting there so I did decorate it a little bit on the bottom but I'm not going to be able to decorate the little boxes on top because there's not enough room so the empty boxes I think I'll put a little something something in and that's what I did so far and then I've clipped together to where we are this week I did decorate it and it's so pretty. It is, I made it kind of school looking. So, and I did find some stickers I had. First day of school is on the 18th. And then I put some little, I think I'm gonna do this throughout any time I decorate in here, is these little um, circle things. So if I have any tasks that I need to do on this date, I can write them here. And then if there's things that are actually happening, I can write it on the top part and I can leave the bottom part for prettiness. So that's what I did so far, is that this for this week, for the week of the 16th to the 22nd, um, she goes back to school and her dad leaves for his camping trip. So I decorated that one. And then that's what I did for this week. And I've got, I also made a folder for seventh grade 
to put, I'll put it in the back of here. I'll just put it in the back of here. But they got an open house tomorrow, so I got to take that with me. But um, yeah, so this is the week of the 16th through the 22nd for August. This is what I've done so far for my planner that we put together together. So this is what it looks like. It's not, I mean, it's decorated, it's pretty. I'm happy with it. Like I said, I'm trying to use what I have. Um, so I'm using up what I have. And yeah, so I made it look kind of nice, kind of cute. So we'll see how it goes as I go. I did do a little bit on next week's stuff. And I don't know if I did anything on the last week. I didn't. Yeah, a little bit, but so I'll be back next week to show you what this one looks like, what it looks like for next week. I don't know if I'll stay on top of this. I'll try. And if not, then I, I'll do like what week I'm on and then I'll go back and show you what I did prior to. So if I do forget, I apologize. But um, yeah, so this is what it looks like so far in my makeshift planner for school, the school year planner, that's what I'm calling it because I'll put everything in here that's happening other than, you know, my content and billing and stuff like that. This will be stuff that's happening like doctor's visits. If my husband has to do something or whatever, he actually got his hair cut today. So that's here. I didn't write it down, but I'll write it in here. He went and got his hair cut. So that is it. I hope you enjoyed it. These are going to get shorter. So, um, at once I get going a little bit, maybe I'll do a decorate with me just so you can see what I do. But right now it's just hodgepodge. And I don't know if you want to see that or not. You can let me know. But um, yeah, so that's so far. Thanks for watching, guys. And we'll see you again soon. Bye.